ladies and gentlemen, I'm the king keeper from the neutral party. Tonight, I'm going to talk about confirmational bias. What is confirmational bias? When you choose to believe in something only to reinforce your own belief and not based on facts and evidence, you have confirmational bias. For example, let's say you don't have any money. I give you a box and I tell you that there are $101 million in it. However, the box is locked. So you want to hire someone to open the lock, but you don't have any money. Ergo, you promise anyone $1 million from the box if he or she can open it. Well, people don't want to work for free. Even if they can open it, they still want to get paid. So you also promise them $10 each just for trying. After 50 years, you got 10 million people to try this lock, and no one could open it except for one person. So you have to pay them a total of $100 million for trying, and $1 million for that one person. When the box is open, everyone can see that there's nothing in the box. So instead of saying that you were wrong, and you wasted everyone's time for 50 years, you make excuses. You tell them, the money is in another dimension, or the money is there, can you prove that it's not there? Or, I can see or touch the money, but you have to believe it to do that. Or, I already pay you the money, but you only get it when you're dead. Imagine if it wasn't 10 million people doing it, it was 10 billion people. Imagine if it wasn't 10 dollars just for trying, this internal life just for believing. Imagine if it hasn't been going on for 50 years, it has been going on for 5,000 years. The investment and the payout would just too high for anyone to admit he or she is wrong. Because you have invested so much of your time and reputation in it, instead of seeing the facts, you intentionally blind yourself than everyone. This is confirmational bias. And that's all for tonight. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Let's click on the mask.